While the NYPD is sponsoring a new day of play, bringing cops into city parks to hang out with the city's kids. It's just one way that the department is trying to curb the spike in violent crime. News 12 Sabrina Franza is at one downtown Brooklyn Park with a look at some of the fun to be had there, Sabrina, <laughs> getting in on it. Yeah, Amanda, normally I would be using this hula hoop on my waist, but the microphone to my excuse makes it impossible to do. But bringing games to 86 city parks across the five boroughs is just one way that the NYPD is trying to establish a greater relationship with the kids in the precincts that they serve. And again, this is happening in 86 different locations every week for at least eight weeks. So I want to give you a look at the fun that's happening. It's unfolding right behind me. This is meant to happen every single Wednesday throughout the summer. They might extend it further, so it could go on longer than eight weeks at 86 city parks across all five boroughs. We did meet one 13 year old boy who was very confident about his one on one game with an officer. Take a listen. Yo, the cops gonna be down like you don't even understand like he's gonna be bleeding. He will be screaming for his wife. And it's definitely not all fun and games. Shootings are up almost 30% since last year, both this year and last. New Yorkers desperate to be out of their homes and spending some time outside in places like city parks. Assistant Commissioner of Youth Strategies Kevin O'Connor explained how occupying a park is just one way to be proactive. They need to be out here to, to protect these kids. It's a tough time right now. We have a lot of things going on, a lot of shootings, a lot of random violence. and. We need to start somewhere. Why not the city parks? Why not our local neighborhood parks? And if you're wondering how to locate the exact park that your precinct is occupying, you can just go onto their personal social media pages. We're told they should be posted individually at each precinct's social media. Amanda. Kids having fun and the officers getting involved too, Sabrina.